Hi, you lovelies, or welcome if you're new here. I'm Linz. I have been going backwards and forwards on a few different recipes for this week, and I think I'm stuck on this one now because I have been practicing different ways to do sort of roast potatoes in the air fryer, and this is by far the best recipe I have come up with so far. So I'm going to bring you down and just show you what I have going on to start with. Now, thanks to so many of you that I suggested one. Um, I do have an induction hob coming at some stage, but unfortunately it's just not here yet. So we're going to have to do it this way. In here, I have got some Maris Piper potatoes and I've kind of tried to cut them up so they're all fairly equal in size. And what I'm going to do is I am going to bring these over and I'm going to pop them onto the stove and I'm going to bring them to a boil and leave them on sort of like a rapid boil for around five minutes and um, I am going to be adding just a little bit of salt into this water. So I'm going to do that now and I will bring you back when they're finished doing their par boil. Now my potatoes reached their boil, I just drained them off and as we can see here they are just steaming off a little bit. Now they've gone a little bit sort of fluffy around the edges which is absolutely perfect and exactly what I want. This will depend on the type of potato you're using as well. If you're using one that is, tends to be really really floury then you'd only maybe want to parboil them for maybe two minutes because the last thing you want to do is end up with mash instead of roast. So I am just now taking um, just some vegetable oil. Now this would probably be better if you had something or if you like it, use um, duck or goose fat. I did have a look at it in the shops and I'm going to be honest, it was far too expensive. So I'm just sticking with what I know. Instead of using another bowl, I am just putting the lid on and we're going to give that a good shake round. It's also going to keep them potatoes a little bit fluffy as well. I've gone too much with the oil, but we're all right. I am using some of my aromat. Now, if you don't like aromat, you could just replace this with some salt. So we just want to give them a good, good sprinkle with that. And my secret ingredient, <laughs> which I've only recently discovered, is semolina. Yep, I thought the same as well. What? <laughs> But trust me, it works wonders. So we are literally just going to sprinkle a good amount of that over the top of them potatoes. I'm going to pop the lid back on and we're going to give them another good shake around until they're all covered. Now, we're going to take drawer one. And we're going to place our roast potatoes or not yet roast potatoes soon to be into the basket try and space them out so they have some nice airflow now now you see them and i am popping these into the air fryer now we've done a couple of experiments on the different kind of presets for this but i am i am going to use the roast now if you have air fry just use air fry we're going at 190 celsius and again i will pop fahrenheit up on the screen and i am putting them in for 20 minutes now, I'm not going to look at them. I'm not going to do anything with them. I'm just going to let them do their thing and we'll be back at the end. If you do have some, you know, different tips and tricks that you use to get your roast potatoes done, please put them down in the comments because, you know, it helps everybody out. I might get some new tips as well, which I'm always really grateful for. But anyway, I'm going to stop yabbering on now and we'll be back when that's done. Now, lovelies, these have just finished their 20 minutes, so I'm going to bring you down so you can see. And there we have my best ever roast potatoes. So, <laughs> no fuss, just kind of set and forget. They are perfectly crispy, crunchy, and just, oh, my days. And we're just going to, if I can get the, you hear that? So, there we go. 
Lovelies, wherever you are, thank you so much for being here. Your support really, really does mean the absolute world to me. You've all kept me going through, you know, most of this year with your fantastic just just being there. And yeah, I really do hope now that them will make your Christmas dinner or, you know, if you've been having trouble with making roast potatoes, because I know some people have commented and asked. So that is that. Do you know, it's the, what is it? It'll be the 19th when you're seeing this video of December and I am yet to put up one Christmas decoration. So after dinner, I think I better start having a route through and seeing what I've got. Take care, lovelies. Make sure that wherever you are, you're just happy, healthy, and that is just the main thing. And yeah, take care. And we shall talk to you all very, very soon in the next one. Bye for now.